Today we'll be making a spaghetti squash dinner, a layered spaghetti squash dinner. Now this squash, it's only grown where it's cold, in cold places. It's a beautiful squash, it's very, it's full of nutrition. It has a lot of potassium, which helps with muscle function and helps to build muscle. It has B6, which helps with enzymes production, and it has vitamin C, which gives your immune system a boost start. The only thing with this squash, the skin is very hard. I wouldn't dare cut it on camera. So, I'll tell you, you just cut it in half, like this, or sometimes you can even put little holes around it and then put it in the oven, wrapped it in foil, of course. But what I do, I cut it in half, scoop the seeds out, and then it looks like this. I scoop the seeds out and then I take it, put it in a foil, aluminum foil. First you rub some olive oil on here and then you put in the aluminum foil. Like this. And then you put in the pan like this. And you put in the oven, let it bake for 20 minutes, 350 degrees. And the way you test it, you always feel the skin. Just keep feeling it like this. If it feels soft, you take it out. 20 minutes, not too soft or else the squash can get mushy. And you would not be able to get a spaghetti, stringy spaghetti. When it's finished, unwrap it. And you let it cool. And then it's ready to for to become spaghetti. Okay. You cannot let this squash overcook. If it overcook, it's going to get mushy. Okay, so you do it like this. See there? Isn't that amazing? See? The one thing about being vegan, you get to meet a whole new lot of, not people, a lot of new vegetables that you never knew about. It's exciting. Vegan don't have to be a boring or a bland diet. See, that's how you get that out. Then we do the other one. You guys see? All the spaghetti. You don't have to use pasta. And this is low in calorie. One cup is about 80 calories and 10 grams of carbohydrates. Low carb, low carb. And very healthy. Okay. And that's our base for our spaghetti squash dinner. Isn't that beautiful?